I'm making a mental note right now, because you know, I'm a competitive man. So when I come here, I'm just feeling the soil. You know, like before you go into battle, you pick up the soil and you just kind of smell it. And you're like, yeah, today's my, my day, my day. I'm going to win. Hey, what's up, guys? Wood here. And this is another episode of Raise Daval where we raise the profiles of groups, characters, and individuals doing amazing things in my city. And today, as you can see, I'm with the Eagle Off-Roaders of Davao for their third Kadayawan Challenge, where we pit the best, the baddest, and the meanest 4 by 4s through a testing ground to crown the champion. All the best from my city are coming together. So without further ado, let me take you on this adventure, this 4x4 challenge, and I might even get in on the action with my little beast. Anyway, Wood here, let's go do this. Let me take you behind the scenes to the control zone. You know like the captain's chair right here? These are all the captains of today's event. And so on this stage is where all the goodness, the fun is going to be coordinated and we're going to set people free, kind of, down this racetrack. All right, so we are right now in the midst of one of the tracks with my brother Nats. Now he is actually the president of the Eagle Off-Roaders and it is him who's actually put this amazing event together today. Brother, today we have some categories to make it available for everybody, yeah, right? You yeah, made it simple. For, so, for newbies. For newbies. Yeah. So what what are the categories and what's the requirements to come in on a on an event like this? Um actually we have a stock showroom category, uh -huh. then we have a stock uh, modified uh, categories. Okay. So they have to do is just bring their four by four and they can go to the and race with us. And race. So, a newbie like me, yeah, you think I'll be able to make this track? Yeah, it's the, the, too, the stock one. Yeah, actually, it's too easy. We we, we make it very friendly. Okay. So, so everybody that, can drive. Yeah, and we make this race just to enjoy. For actually, it's for the new newbie so that they can understand how to engage their four by four truck. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. So it's a learning yeah. stage as well. So for all of you newbies out there that have wanted to try out your 4x4 and have never actually ventured from 2 to 4, this is the place to come. Yeah. And yeah. you're in safe hands because if you get stuck, and I'll tell you, I've got stuck in some of his tracks that I've tried my little patrol on. Yeah, but this but is very easy. That this is, he says it's easy. I hope I'm not being set up and I get stuck. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway. So, Nats, brother, thank you thank for you, putting this you. together. Thank and you, I'm thank excited. You. We're about to launch now, right? Yeah, yeah. We're about We're to about take to off. We're about to start the race. All right, so we better get off the track. I don't want us, either of us to die. We got family and children, you know what I'm saying? So, brother, thank okay, you. Let's okay, go do this. You, Let's you. do this. All right, guys, so let, let me take you through the process of signing up and getting in on the action, because I am doing it today. So come with me, come, come, come. We're at the control zone. Palihog, can I sign up? Palihog, these are the gentlemen that make everything happen up in this place. So explain, explain to me, mga amigo dere. How do I sign my life away to get on this track? If you sign, you use ball pen first. Ball pen first, thank then you, sir. We... Hey, by the way, this is my uh, co-host. You see, we both wearing white. We, we coordinated, right, brother? Put yeah, it there, yeah. put it there. All right, all right, all right. So we be signing up, we put our names in, Name, address, address phone. car information. Okay, okay, okay. Let, me, let me just write it up. And then, what else do I got to do, man? Is that it? Yeah, yeah. Gonna We're done, you're gonna cut me off? This is the fun of being part of the Eagle Off-Roaders. You see, their slogan is where the road ends, the fun begins. But I've gotta say, actually, these guys are a lot of fun all the time. And actually, this program is more than just having fun here which we'll explain a little later. We come and reach into our community here in Davao. This is why I'm so just privileged really to be a part of this team. Eagle Off-Roaders are rocking it. I'm signing my life away. I've never done this, so I'm gonna take you on this journey with me. Let's go. Oh yeah, I'm official now. Official right here. See that? 
but I just hope I can make it. Let's do this. Okay, so this is the walkthrough. We're walking through the track. So there's two tracks, right, Ben? So we got track A and track B. It goes at the same time. Stock showroom. So we're walking the track right now. And just to let everybody know, including myself, because I'm going to drive this track, that this is how we got to go. I'm making a mental note right now, because you know, I'm a competitive man. So when I come here, I'm just feeling the soil. You know, like before you go into battle, you pick up the soil and you just kind of smell it. And you're like, yeah, today's my, my day, my day. I'm going to win. Probably not. I'm probably totally lying, but I'm going to pretend that it's like that. You know what I'm saying? Because this is Eagle Off-Roaders. There is no road, so the fun has already begun. And I'm using my legs. See, everybody here gets a workout. You come to Eagle Off-Roaders, you get a bit of exercise. You walk in the sun, make sure to drink. Look guys, let me just clarify, all right? I'm still walking on track A, and this is track B. So once you get through, brother, we go through that little... And what is that? Is that the finish line? No, no. We gotta go through monkey bars. You gotta do 10 pull-ups. Get out your truck, do some 10 pull-ups on the monkey bars, get back in your truck and drive. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> you just gotta drive through the monkey bars. I'm taking you with me because I've never done this myself. So we'll just have to see. My truck will fit. My truck will fit. So good. These are all our brothers that we're gonna be riding together, right? Oh. What's up, bro? You're gonna ride also? I am, gonna dude. Join? I'm gonna join you guys, man. Right, so we're just trying to describe this part. This is the figure of eight section. So once you get here, you see this tree? We're gonna drive through here. You're gonna make a nice tight turn, go through the bumps, cut right through these two trees, come around that bend, come back and out. Then he's trying to start. <laughs> so he's, ex he's explaining track B. This is the trick. He's explaining that you gotta go around this loop and then exit back out. There's a caveat. If you touch that post, here, let me show you, come with me. If you touch this post, you get an automatic deduction. You get a penalty if you hit this. So you want to drive smoothly in, out. And it's time, man. So you got to do this fast. Don't go too slow. Let's see. Let's do this. All right, so the raffle is being taken to have the first runners, the first players, the first drivers to take track A and track B of the stock showroom category. So we are on. We're about to lift off right here. This is the Eagle Off-Roaders of Davao. Then he's over my shoulder. He's about to launch. He's giving me a little. Once he hits this, he's on. The timer's set. We got our first hit. Let's do this. Okay, one, two, three, go! Ready to hold on for your life? All right, here we go, baby. <laughs> We're running, Henry. Ah! Let's see what this beast can do, baby. All right, I gotta try that. What's my time? Yeah, boy! Yeah, boy! <laughs> We're first, baby. Number one. <laughs> Look, I do gotta let you know that I have never ridden that track before. And I'm just hoping my truck is still alive because I seriously gave it a beating. And Henry, I could see the fear in Henry's eyes as he was holding on to his camera and to his life. If you haven't done four-wheeling yet, you gotta do this. This is so much fun. All right, track A. Two, three. Here we go, track A, baby. Golly, Henry. 
This is crazy business, bro. I gotta make that. Oh, I didn't make it. I gotta burn this, baby. Oh, yeah. Woo! I'm making it in. Okay. Oh, don't touch nothing. Don't touch nothing. This beast is too big for this street. Golly. Okay. Oh, come on. I gotta make it through. What we got, brother? Ah, oh, good job, man. It's only soon. I got stuck. My my figure of eight wasn't very pretty. Lisut got you. Salamat. So that is how it feels. I hope you enjoyed that to ride here with the Eagle Off-Roaders of Davao. It really is fun. There is no road. It's all fun. No road. It's all fun. Okay, so now we're going to the stock showroom modified section. So this is a little tougher. Your tires got to be 33 inches. Just a little extra modification. We're going to go through it and walk that through and see what kind of trouble these drivers can expect. So come with me. Let's do this. We're walking through now. We just driven through the start line. So you're going to come down this big first dip. We're going to come through. You're going to drive up. Look at all these rivets. Look, I'm going to disappear in a hole. That's why you need bigger tires, right? Can I come around? Good night. Then come down, follow me. What's up, gentlemen? Those guys got the right idea. Look, they're chilling. Kumusta? Mayung tulug. Oh, I wish I could. <laughs> what do I mean, seriously, what are you gonna do? They gotta get a nice rest, so. So you get to this bit, you gotta do a figure of eight pattern again. The stock modified, they're gonna have to go down here through the river, go around the mountain top, and go back through. Two choices. That's difficult. Let's see how they do this. Anyway, let's stop talking and let's get to the show, shall we? Booyah! My brother right here is about to open up the stock modified racing. So he's strapped up his hands. He's coming prepared. Let's pray Godspeed, God safety, um, and lots of fun. For a while, uh. This is kind of wild because okay, this will, track is a little harder. Brother, all the best. Thank you, bro. God bless you, man. Thank you. The stock show road, he's done, he's going. Ready. I love it. This is extreme off-road racing, but we had a brother who did a fantastic job. You know, he kind of slipped, and I'm going to show you what happened. As he went to the finish line, he just smacked it. Anyway, we have our first crash right here. It's a good day, isn't it? Is it a good day? Yeah. It's a good day to be alive, isn't it? Yeah. And today, even though we saw people tumbling and rolling like the cruisers, they came out safe. You see, we have so much to be thankful for, amen? And so before I pray, I want you to get in the mindset of knowing that who this joy comes from. It comes from God. He's given us breath and life. So when I pray, I want you guys to remember from whom all good things come from, our Amahan Salangin. Heavenly Father, we just thank you for Karunat Lao. 
I thank you, Lord, for this community. I thank you, Lord God, for this city. I thank you, Lord God, for the life that you've given each and every one here today. I just ask, Lord, that everything that we are, everything we do, would glorify your name, Lord Jesus. We just thank you, Lord, for safety for every person that's been involved today. And I ask for onward safety for tomorrow's festivities, Lord God. And above all else, Father, I pray that we would draw near to you. As for, Father, you have given us so much life and goodness. We thank Thank you, Lord. Sanala ne Jesus, we pray. Amen. Amen. Hey, guys, we know that this is a fun event, but for you guys that are part of Eagle Off-Roaders, we are more than just a bunch of motor junkies, are we not? We are involved in giving back to our community. And here, we want to give back, right? And so you guys, if you've been following social media, these guys have been doing it for years. So it is an honor for me to be a part of it. I'm proud to say I'm an Eagle Off-Roader because you know why? We give back. So while we're having fun, we're making a difference. And you know what? That's the heart of our Amahan Salamit, the Father in Heaven. Amen? Amen. So today, I, it is my pleasure to introduce a friend of mine. He's come here. His name is Carlos Sales. He's a missionary, he travels all over the world, and he has an awesome story. So would you mind giving him five minutes just to share his life? Is that okay, Doc? Okay, because we know we're more than just motor junkies, right? Amen. Carlos, I can give it to you, bro. All right. Thank you, Wood. Well, it's great to be here with you tonight. You know, I was born with speed in my blood. So my father and my mother were in Hong Kong, living in Hong Kong. My mother is Chinese and my father is Portuguese and he was a Grand Prix racer. So in the 50s and 60s, he used to come to the Philippines and race and in Macau, so he used to race all around. When I was growing up as a teenager, I thought I had everything. I had a beautiful girlfriend. I had um, a good school. I had a car. I had everything. But I still felt lonely. I felt like something was missing until one day somebody invited me to go to a concert. And what they shared that day changed my life forever. This is what I heard. I heard that we were all sinners and fallen short of the glory of God. So there's nothing that we can do to be right with God. That Jesus was sent by his Father God to come down to die for our sins. And because of that, we could have a relationship with God the Father. So he was the one that bridged that gap between man and God the Father. All of a sudden, the light came on for me when I found out that all I needed to do was ask God to forgive me of my sins, come into my life, and that he would give me the Holy Spirit and make me come alive again spiritually, and I would be able to communicate with God the Father in heaven. And that's what I did. I just bowed my head. I ask God for forgiveness. I ask him to take control and be the driver of my life. He got in the driver's seat from that day on. That was the best decision that I ever made in my whole life. So I ask you, if you're trying to drive on your own and you find yourself going on all kinds of journeys, but always on the wrong road, I ask you to ask God to be the driver of your life. So thank you for, sh for allowing me to share tonight. Thank you very much. Uh, this certificate is given to Mr. Otto Derquito. So I would like to call on Mr. Otto Derquito. Thank you, sir. Hey, what's up guys? This is day two of the Eagle Off-Roaders of Davao Kadeya 1 4x4 event. The place is alive because we're setting up for the final events to crown folks champion over their categories today. So they're still gonna be racing, but it's to decide who is the best of the best. Everybody's a little tired because we had a fantastic evening 
We had fire dancers. We had lots of food at the fellowship night. We had guests from the US speaking. This place is really rocking it, and it's a great way to raise up our city here in Davao. What a fantastic community to be a part of. So anyway, let's go check out what's going on, and let's get this party started. See you. about to crown the winners of various categories. My brother here is announcing the winners. We're about to finish this. We're gonna find out who's crowned the king of each show. Don't underestimate, because one of the smaller rides here is crowned the king. Just because it's a smaller ride doesn't mean you can't take the crown. We're right here, brother. For the stock modified, again, the time is three. Right up here. 14.16 seconds. Oh yeah. This dude right here is a stock modified champ. He's rocked it out today. Big congrats, brother. Oh yeah. All, All right. right. To this right here. <laughs> Give him a clap. Yeah. Yeah. All right, the champion, champion for the stock showroom. Right yes, God, that's the champion over there. I just want to mention, already 4x4 off-roaders. Yes. These are the crown champions right here. This is all about their moment. Let's give them a clap. Yes. Yes. Eagle off-roaders, let's raise them out. See ya.